Hello YouTube, welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're doing what if Sasuke went back in time. Let's get into the All right, so this what if um starts off with Sasuke and Nagar um Sasuke after Naruto's death. Um, so in this in this one, Sas Naruto had died after um had didn't okay he wasn't rescued in time to you know how do I say this? Okay, so his I don't know how to kill Naruto. I really don't. Okay, eventually Naruto will die. This is like before the Ishiki and um versus Barry and Mo Naruto fight. And this is when Sasuke is approached by Hagoromo. <clears throat> and um in his mindscape. Hagoromo would tell Sasuke that he needs to go gather all nine Biju. Telling him that um Kurama would if he was to um if he was to give him some of his chakra he could force Kurama, um, he could force Kurama to, you know, come back within a day. And, you know, Sasuke would, um, accept this mission. And when it's done, um, Sasuke would have went and gathered all, eight, all nine Biju, leaving some Biju inside of their Jinchurikis, which is actually just Killer B and Naruto for the moment. So he would, um, leave Killer B with just enough chakra to survive, but would take majority of the eight tails. To which Hagoromo will seal the nine Biju into a tattoo, like into you know those little green orbs that they were in at first. He would then seal them inside of a, um, a seal for Sasuke to have on him. So he would tell Sasuke that he's going to train him to go back in time, and also another ability that he's going to give him. And Sasuke will ask is if he's going back in time, will he be back in his child body? Hagoromo will tell him that the time. The reason why he will be sending him back in time is because um, when Sasuke would time travel, this one, his his younger version, he will be sent back to um, a little bit before the Chunin exams, telling him that his younger version, of Sasuke, will never walk the good path. That eventually, he is to uh, Sasuke. That Sasuke is to die. <clears throat> telling him that he could eventually save that he could save Itachi. He won't be able to save the Uchiaka, but he can save Itachi. Telling him that he is not to train his younger self, but to train Naruto and to seal all other nine BGs within Naruto. And will tell him to ask Sakura to make the um the medicine for the sickness that Naruto had got for holding all nine Biju. And see would Sasuke would do this and would also grab this and seal this away. And Sasuke would then go with training through Hagoromo. Hagoromo would then teach Sasuke an ability that he had. It was a, it allowed him to create his own pocket dimension for training, where he can unleash his full power and go all out, along with um, him being able to control the time in it. And he would also tell Sasuke to focus on using his space-time um, portal thing, but instead of focusing on space and time, focus on just time. You know, a couple months later, Sasuke would eventually get to this because um, Jigen had already got to Kawaki, Kawaki, and everything, forcing Sasuke to leave behind everyone that he loves. So Sasuke would appear in, back in Konoha, at the, um back in Konoha. Well, not really in Konoha on the outskirts of Konoha. When he would walk in, the burial court would tell them that um that someone who has a very similar chakra to Sasuke is inside of Konoha. And, you know, with Yujin being Hokage, he would send um he him and some Ambu would appear in front of Sasuke. To which Sasuke would say, May I help you? As Yujin would say, I should be asking you the same thing. What are you doing in Konoha? To which Sasuke would say, I'm here to um <clears throat> Help rebuild my clan, if you could say that. 
which you usually want to ask, what clan is that exactly? And Sasuke will say the Uchiha clan. Sasuke will then tell Hughes that he wants a private audience with only him. And he will tell um, Hughes that his Anbu cannot know of this until their um, conversation is over. Of course, Hughes will um, see Sasuke's, um, like, see Sasuke move his band, um, not his bandage, uh, his hair a little bit for his Rinnegan to be uncovered. And Sasuke would then cast again Jutsu, not allowing to the Anbu, allowing the Anbu not to hear his last conversation about the Uchiha. So Chiyuzin would ask, what did he do? And he, Sasuke would basically explain that he put again Jutsu that until that conversation is over, the, the Anbu won't report any of this to anyone and no one would know. He would cover his eye. It's Chiyuzin would nod and would allow Sasuke into his office. Poor Sasuke um, would, and Hiruzen would have a conversation. Sasuke would start off by telling him that he is not, uh, he is an Uchiha, but not one that survived the massacre. But well, he's the one that survived the massacre. To which Hiruzen would say the one that survived the massacre. He says the only one that survived was Sasuke. To which Sasuke will not, as he would say exactly. Um, Sasuke Uchiha from the future. To which Hiruzen would say, but... One that is Sasuke would tell him no. He says when he came back in time, it changed certain events. <clears throat> as he was in would say, if you're Sasuke from the future, then why why are you here? As he as Sasuke um, allows the great nine orbs to come out. As he was in says, those are the the biju from my time. You see, in the future, Naruto has a relationship with all nine biju, and he's able to use a power called Sage of the Six Paths. Because of this power, Naruto has become the most powerful shinobi to live. Um, from um, my estimate, Naruto short um, if Naruto was trained more often with me, he would have been able to. Me and him would have been able to surpass the Sage of Six Paths himself. Hiruzen will not. He says. So what are you gonna do now? He says I will be training Naruto Uzumaki. I want you to let Sasuke know, I want you to let the council know of my appearance as an Uchiha. But they will not be forcing me to train Sasuke no matter what. And I want you to tell them, Sasuke, Sasuke begins to go by, I don't try to think of a name. <clears throat> she will then say, my name is Indra Uchiha. Two choose will nod. She will will say, what are you, tr why, wait, why did you come back? Before the tuning exams, Sasuke says because by the time me and Naruto are finished for the tuning exams, Naruto will be probably at around his teenage self, which was comparable to the first Okage. To which um, he was in he would then ask, "Does he know the truth about Itachi?" And Sasuke would not. Yes, he would tell. Yes, he was in. Um, Sasuke would then tell he was in that. In this world, since he came back, Sasuke would eventually state, would um, go to Orochimaru, that this has to happen for Naruto. And would then tell him that that's, Naruto was supposed to bring him back originally, but because of his presence here, <clears throat> Sasuke, um, this Sasuke, because he basically created a new timeline with him being here, that this Sasuke will always stay evil and won't never come back, so that he'll eventually have to kill him. And he would tell him that he's going to kill Sasuke. When it comes to him fighting his, um, when his younger self fights Itachi in the future. And here's will nod at this, saying that as long as he's here, the Uchiha clan could pros prosper. Here's Sasuke will nod. <clears throat> so here's him would then give him a Konoha headband. To which Sasuke would say, um, that he has one that if, as he says that if anyone asks, it was scratched during the Kayubi attack when he left. He left, that he left shortly after the Kayubi attack and that it was scratched. Then, um, while fighting the Kayubi. She was in one night. And, um, Sasuke would don his headband. Or, um, well, not don it. I don't want Sasuke wearing that fucking headband. Well, I could have him do like a Kakashi type thing, but no. He's gonna have his headband on his belt. What she was in one night. <clears throat> and she says, Welcome. Yoni Indra Uchiha. Says, I believe it's time to call a council meeting and for Sasuke. And with Sasuke. How much are you going to tell them, though? 
that I'm an Uchiha, that I have full mastery over my Sharingan along with the final stage of it. As he will reveal his his Rinnegan. To which um, Hiruzen will be shocked. He's, he knows that I from Jiraiya's descriptions. So the Rinnegan is the final the final um the final form of the Sharingan. Yes. As he would say the Rinnegan goes from um the Sharingan goes from one to three, then to Mangeko, then eternal. And then eventually, but only telling him that only Hashi Hashirama and Madara Hashirama and his in his chakra or Naruto and Sasuke's chakra can make the Rinnegan. He says it's because of Naruto and Sasuke being reincarnations of the Sage of Six Past children, and along with Hashirama and um, Madara being that too, saying that that's why the Uchiha clan and the Senju clan are rivals, and why that entire war, um, and why Madara eventually fought Hashirama for it. Saying that it was just some fight between brothers for going on for centuries. He was able to say, all right. Yes, he was able to release the seals in the room and they would call a council meeting along with Sasuke Uchiha. <clears throat> so Sasuke um, will be called to the meeting telling, uh, with him saying that, well, with him being told that there, there's someone who wants to speak with him. <clears throat> so now um, in the council meeting, Hiruzen will tell them that another Uchiha has been found. And Sasuke will be shocked to hear this, thinking that it's prob possibly Itachi. To which he will ask, where is he? To which Hiruzen would allow, say, come in. And so, to which older Sasuke will come back. He says, I would like to introduce you guys to Indra Uchiha. As he was, as Donzo and the elders were asked, where was he all these years? As Indra says that he, um, Sasuke would they say that he left during the, after the Kayubi attack because he had lost some family members. <clears throat> to which, you know, they would, um, he was then would then give them fabricated papers saying that his truth, that he was once a part of Konoha, that he was a Jonin. So Donzo and them have to begin began to plot. Um, Donzo be, is beginning to plot to have Sasuke removed. To which Sasuke would then ask, "Is he going to? Will he train him in, with the use of the Sharingan?" To which Donzo and the elders would ask, "What could he bring to the village?" Sasuke would, would show off. I believe it's his right eye. Yeah, his Rinnegan, saying, "I can bring the final form of the Sharingan, his final mutation." Renegon to the village. And I have full mastery over my Sharingan. Absolute control. I have, my Sharingan is at its strongest. Sasuke would um then have um activated Sharingan. To which some of the to which the civilians would tell order him to train Sasuke. To which he says that he will not. That he will choose who he trains. That even he does not care if Sasuke is an Uchiha. He is a joining of of the Hidden Leaf Village, not a civilian, and they won't they won't um tell him to train Sasuke like they did Kakashi. He would then tell them that he's choosing to take on a student, and then when he finds this student, that'll be it. He won't train anyone else. To which Sasuke will then leave, or older Sasuke. Now younger Sasuke will be seething that another clan member won't even train him to kill Itachi. And eventually, you know, Sasuke will leave. Now, the um, civilians then yell at Hiruzen saying that he cannot allow that man to not train Sasuke. To which Hiruzen will say that it doesn't matter if he doesn't train Sasuke or not because it's his choice. He is a joining of the village. It's his choice on who he trains. That they can't order him or force him to train anyone. Even as the Hokage, if he chooses not to train someone, he, he just chooses not to. That not even a daimyo can force anyone to do this. <clears throat> um, he was in with dismiss the council and they will he was go back to his office where he would have a talk with Sasuke. Chris Sasuke would then reveal everything about Donzo, telling him that his root is still operational, telling him that the real real reason Shisui was dead was because Donzo stole his eye and Shisui killed himself, giving his other eye to um Itachi. 
saying that that's why they had to perform um they they had to perform the massacre. Now he was going to be extremely pissed off at this, but um you know Sasuke will tell him that eventually Donzo will get what's coming to him. That he'll take that eye back just like he took he'll take the eye that just like Shisui took. And then he will tell him that Donzo had um Hashirama cells implemented into his other arm along with other Sharingan from the massacre saying that his main ability is a thing called Izanagi which allows someone to rewrite reality causing him to not die saying that an overall Sharingan he can use it a total of 11 times but chooses not to use Shisui's eyes so it's normally 10 so here's him will understand and will tell him to continue his plot as he would say so you're going to train Naruto now, right? He says, yes. He says, I would also like you to call Kakashi into the vill um, call Kakashi in here. As my sensei and as the six Okage. He resembled jaw will drop. He says, wait, who are all the Kokages from your village? And do they know how to defeat paperwork? Sasuke will laugh. Getting a little chuckle, he says, yes. The key to paperwork is the shadow clones. And the previous Hokages in um, last to first, Naruto Uzumaki, the eighth Hokage, seventh Hokage, Kakashi Hatake, the sixth, Tsunade Senju, the fifth Hokage, Naruto's father, the fourth Hokage, Minato Namikaze, Yu, Tobirama, and then Hashirama. And so she would say, I've also met all of them. He was then then sit down to Anbu to uh, call Anbu and then send it out to go get Kakashi. To which Kakashi would arrive, you know, a couple minutes, um, not a couple minutes ago, like an hour later. To which when he would arrive, Sasuke would pin him against the wall. To which Kakashi would look at Hughes and his Hughes and says, Kakashi, this is the one time you cho you does not need, do not need to be late. He says, what? Sasuke then says, why shouldn't I hurt you for wasting my time? Hatake. She says, you're the, yes, the new Uchiha. But there's something secretive about me that we would like to tell you. Which reason will call, um, do a prophecy barrier and everything. And they will begin to explain to Kakashi that he's Sasuke from the future. Telling him that his Sasuke would eventually defect, but he would have to teach him the Chidori. Saying that Sasuke defecting is an important piece in time. Saying that this Sasuke will never turn back to the, become good again and come back to the village. That this Sasuke would eventually be killed off by his future self. Well, by himself. And Kakashi would agree. Saying that um, Sasuke will also tell him that he's going to take over his training along with Jiraiya when Jiraiya comes. Of Naruto. Which Kakashi would um would not and would then keep have, be forced to forced into secrecy by a seal that he was an implement onto Kakashi, so Kakashi cannot speak of these events. <clears throat> so they released the seal and Sasuke, I, uh, and um. Sasuke would ask Kakashi to take him to meet his um to meet Naruto this time. So Kakashi would eventually do this and they will meet Naruto. They've just gotten back from the wave mission. And Kakashi has told um is about to tell his team about the tuning his ass. Well eventually will tell his team about the tuning his ass. Twitch Sasuke will say, if you're gonna tell them, then I want you to introduce me to Naruto then. <clears throat> and I want you to go and train Sasuke. And Sasuke as Kakashi says he doesn't know if he wants to anymore. Because he knows how Sasuke is going to become. Tracy said Sasuke won't be a problem. That he'll eventually be dealt with. Saying that no matter how strong Sasuke gets in his time. He will never be as strong as Smee as himself. So Kakashi will agree. And later that week. He would um, then tell the team that he's going to be. Um, he. What is it called? He nominated them for the tuning exams. And then we would tell Naruto that he's going to be training Sasuke. We would then tell Naruto that someone here, that someone wants to train him, that they picked him out as to be a student along with someone else, but that won't, but they won't be here until the one month, well, between, till a, a little bit during the tuning exams. Towards Naruto, ask where is this person? Towards Sasuke will come. 
to which Sasuke will be in seething. She says, you chose Naruto, a clanless idiot, the dead last, over your own clan member to train him. To which Sasuke will nod, yes. As he says, the Hokage talked to me about Naruto. Naruto, Naruto works hard. I've heard about your mission. Naruto worked hard to get where he's at. He defeated, Hak um, as far as I know, as you guys know, it's Haku the ice user. Naruto got Kakashi out of that water prison due to his shadow clones. All you did was throw a shuriken. Naruto has progressed the furthest, and Naruto also has something to prove. You have nothing to prove. All you are um, driven by is revenge, and I won't train a student driven by revenge. She, he would tell Naruto to follow him, to which Naruto would leave, sticking his tongue out at Sasuke. And Sasuke would begin seething. Kakashi would tell Sasuke to come on if they're going to train. Telling Sakura that she can go um, train with Kurenai. Saying that Kurenai doesn't, um, her students are training with their clans at the moment. So she is free from for now. <clears throat> so now Sasuke would then um, have Naruto. Um, how do I want Naruto to do this? I don't want to. Yes, I know what to do. It's Naruto, Sasuke would tell Naruto to stay with him. Where Sasuke would use his um, little portal thing to go into his um, training reality or training time space training place. Anyway, I'm not to walk in. <clears throat> to where Sasuke would then, I'm um, not to ask Sasuke what are they doing in here. He says, This is where they're going to be training for the next two months. To which, you know, Naruto will say that there's nothing that they can do in two months. Sasuke says that in this world, um, that the Chunin Zans is like, you know, next week. He would say that in this world, two months, I can make it as long as I want. Two months to two years to maybe even 20 if I wanted to. Saying that in here, <clears throat> he's going to um, train him to be as strong as possibly um, the Hokage. Naruto would be the Genradis. Sasuke would then tell Naruto to close his eyes. No, 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 no. Sasuke would tell him to look into his eyes, to which Sasuke would reveal his Sharingan and his Zenigan. As they would appear into the mindscape, to which he would then cast again Jutsu in the mindscape on Naruto. And would then cast again Jutsu on the QB when it opens his eyes, showing the QB, <clears throat> basically showing the, Ka the Kaiubi everything. About his future self, and from the memories that Sasuke got from his um, from older Naruto, I, I don't know if Sasuke was. I believe Sasuke was on the battlefield when Naruto began to share his memories through his, um, through the Kaiubi cloak and everything. I'm not sure, but yes. So the Kaiubi will understand and will then ask where is his um, future self. To which the um Sasuke would then um hold out. Um, nine balls is he would then see his brother. Kairi would see his brothers and sisters, which he would not. And Sasuke would then rip off the seal for the fourth Okage to appear. And Sasuke would then tell the fourth Okage everything, saying that he's going to train Naruto to make him super powerful. He's going to surpass probably even a third Okage, maybe even himself. He will also tell the fourth Okage that he should talk to Naruto and tell him everything. Towards Minato would do is Sasuke would release Naruto from the Genjutsu. As Minato wouldn't um would tell Naruto that he is his father and everything, telling him that he's sorry for selling the Kayubi and why he did it. To which um Minato would before he faced would then release the Kayubi. Because I believe even though Minato put Minato did put a key on that scroll. So uh, obviously I believe Minato would have the key. Would also have a key to the seal. So he would um, release the Kaiyubi for the Kaiyubi to then tell Naruto that he is going to allow him, that he's going to fight him to become as powerful as he can. <clears throat> so, so um, you know, um, Naruto and the Kaiyubi will fight. The Kaiyubi will force itself not into his full BG form, but into the size of like um, Akamaru at the um, beginning of Shippuden. And they will begin their fight. Now, eventually, the, Naruto will last a little bit longer than the Kaiyubi expected. The Kaiyubi expected Naruto to, um, you know, fail within, um, or to 
to get to be defeated within the first 30 seconds. But Naruto lasted a full three minutes with Kaiyubi, earning its respect. So the Kaiyubi will then tell Naruto to use his chakra to grab onto his and to then pull it. And pull it as much as possible. And then um, the Kaiyubi will tell Naruto that he's going to show him resistance, that he has to work hard for this. Now, eventually, Naruto will get almost all of it, to which the Kaiyubi will begin to um, force its hatred onto Naruto. Now, this is when um, Naruto's other side would appear. So, Sasuke would then kill its other side. Or not really kill it. He would actually sit, um, put the other side into a Genjutsu that forces it to um, combine with Naruto. So, the and forces Naruto to accept his hatred and everything. To become one with his other half. And Naruto would do this. So now Sasuke. Um, now Naruto would eventually meet his mother and everything. And that would happen. He, he would ask his mother everything. All of these things and all that. And now um, Naruto would eventually defeat the Kaiyubi. Taking it. Uh, well not defeat the Kaiyubi. He's already done that. Um, not really done that. But he would take the Kaiyubi's chakra. Having him enveloped in the Kaiyubi. KCM1 aura. Chakra Cloak. Now, Naruto, at the moment, Sasuke will tell Naruto that in here, he's going to extend the time to around six months so that he can build his body so that he could, you know, get this done. And then he would, um, Sasuke would then have Naruto leave the mosque. And Naruto would be pretty tight when he pass out. Which, um, Sasuke, when Sasuke, Naruto would do this, Sasuke would grab all, have all the nine orbs come out and then would slam his hand into Naruto's, onto Naruto's seal, forcing the orbs into Naruto. And Sasuke, Naruto's um, younger body can't handle it, so Sasuke will see the sickness coming out immediately. So Sasuke will give Naruto the medicine and, uh, or the the cure to it, basically a cure. And would then, the, um, Naruto will then start training Naruto's body. So six months later, Naruto will come out of the, the um and Sasuke will come out of the time space. And to which Sasuke would tell Naruto that he's going to go that he should go to his house, saying that he's going to bring him some clothes for him to wear. To which um Sasuke, Naruto would not and would go to his own house. To which Sasuke would go and buy Naruto some um new clothes, it being some black ombu clothes. You know. I can't really decide what to have Naruto wear, so let me see right quick. All right, so I got it. So Sasuke would get Naruto, uh, have Naruto wear um, not black ombu pants, but the black version of the pants that Kakashi has, along with black sandals or black shinobi sandals. Not like his, but like, you know, um, Shippuden Naruto's. And then we'll have him get uh, we'll get him his um the top half of his um, Shippuden clothes, of his Shippuden outfit. Well, the shirt shirt for his Shippuden outfit, which is the black um jacket thing with the orange trimming things, that and we'll then get him a cloak like his that on the um on the back it has the kanji for um six pass. As Naruto will also have um would also have I don't want to give him a sword I really don't so I won't give him that. It's a cloak much like Sasuke's. It's his is black. But on the bottom it has um red flames. And his and he will have a new headband. Which is much um which I'm not new um not I was about to say red, which is actually basically she put in a headband with the black the black um band thing and you know the shinobi sim the Konoha symbol. So yes, this is now what Naruto was wearing. <clears throat> so um, now um, Naruto would go, and Sasuke would begin to head out for the Chunin exams. Um, for the start of the Chunin exams, Twist. Sasuke says, "Have you perfected the Rasen Shuriken?" Twist. Naruto would tell him no. He says that he'll have it done. Um, he'll have it done by then. Twist. Sasuke would tell him that if he passes, um. Tell him that he has the time to finish it, but it's only if he passes the first two exams. Telling him that no one should be able to defeat him if he was to go into the first Kayubi, um, Kayubi, Kayubi Chakra mode, the first version. 
which Naruto will not. As he would say, should I go into, you know, um, the version 2 Bijou form or, you know, QB Taco mode? Sasuke says that probably version 2 QB, um, version 2 of QB Chakra, filled with rage. Saying, telling Naruto that since he accepted his dark side, that he has full control over that now. Naruto and I didn't want to accept this. And Sasuke would then um, meet up with Kakashi, and Kakashi would ask, How was his training? To which Sasuke who says that Naruto has gotten full mastery over the Kaiyubi's chakra. Saying that he has developed, um, as soon as Sasuke would just then reveal his ring on and show Kakashi the memories through Genjutsu. Saying that, um, Kakashi would be shocked to hear that, you know, Naruto's almost completed the Rasengan, like fully completed it. Like he completed it by adding one chakra, but is taking that up a level. So, um, now Kakashi would tell him that is he going to watch the exam. Twist, Kakashi, um, Sasuke would not say yes. And we then put Kakashi to the side, saying that Orochimaru is going to attack the team, that this has to happen. <clears throat> Telling and he says that he has told Naruto that, uh, um, he, uh, he told, nah, I won't have him tell Naruto. He's told, um, Kakashi that Naruto's going, most likely going to use the Kaiyubi's, um, rage, his, um, version 2 Biju code. Telling, um, telling him that Orochimaru is eventually going to give Sasuke a curse mark and that this has to happen. So no matter what, do not interfere. Kakashi will nod and they will continue on to tune in the sound. So the next part we pick up is in the preliminaries. Because um, Sasuke still got the curse mark and everything. Kakashi sealed it away. Now, Orochimaru was extremely surprised to see Naruto has... Um, Naruto really has full control over the uh, his Kaiyubi... Uh, his um, Jichuriki forms. You know, the Kaiyubi chakra. So that gave Orochimaru a shock. He was extremely weakened after this. But by the time the uh, next round starts, Orochimaru will be full health. <clears throat> so now, um, they Naruto, we were really going to go through matches. So it's mostly the same. Now, Naruto versus Kiba, that's actually a very embarrassing. So let's get into that. So um, um, the part will call down Naruto and Kiba. And Naruto would get down. In front of Kiba, Twitch Kiba says, Just because you got a new outfit doesn't mean anything. Twitch Naruto will look at the older Sasuke, Twitch that Sasuke would nod his head. Twitch Naruto will then tell Kiba that he's going to defeat him. And it's truly, he means truly going to hurt. Naruto begins to take his cloak off as he throws it up to um, the older Sasuke, who catches it. Kashi looks, looks at Sasuke. And wonders why didn't he catch it with both arms? To which he asks him what happened to it. Um, why didn't he use both arms? To which Sasuke would say he doesn't have the other one. Kashi would not, not expecting this. <clears throat> so now, um, Naruto and um, Kiba's match will start. So Kiba will begin to try to use Gatsuga. But Naruto, um, or I don't know how you say it, or, um, not rotation. His. Yeah, I, I believe it's Gatsuga, Yuga, Gatsuga. The little doggy thing. I don't really give a fuck about Kiba. I'm going to be honest. I don't really know none of his YouTubes. And when Kiba would try to hit Naruto with it, Naruto's, um, one of Naruto's arms began to form a Rasengan. This Kakashi said, yes, so Sasuke says, I, I can't copy it. Now, it's actually because Naruto formed the Rasengan too fast for Sasuke to copy it with his um, Sharingan. All he's seeing is how it's rotating and everything, how the finished product. That's all Sasuke is seeing at the moment. To which Naruto would then slam the Rasengan into the um, the two spinning dog people. <laughs> so sorry. <laughs> and would then, um, this would actually overwhelm Kiba due to the rotation. To which the high, um, Hinata and Neji would be shocked to see this. Because this looks like a full version of their rotation, but it's not. But they think that it, this could possibly defeat the rotation. So they would tell Hiyashi about this eventually. Or um, Hinata will. But Neji will, t well, Neji will most definitely. And um, Naruto would then 
put Kiba um no when Kiba hits the ground, Naruto will grab his foot. He will then lift Kiba and Kiba and throw him directly into the ceiling. Which will shock everyone that Naruto is that strong. Because Naruto begins to channel some of QB's chakra into his legs and will disappear, appearing right of, above Kiba. As Naruto then says, Sorry about this, Kiba. Naruto says, The mess of Rasengan. He will slam the Rasengan into Kiba's back, causing Kiba to pass out when he hits the ground, or be knocked out when he hits the ground. Crowning Naruto the winner. Now, that's truly embarrassing because, let's be honest, Kiba didn't land a hand on Naruto. And it even didn't take that long for this to happen. This took happen within like a minute of a match. So, it really was nothing. So, time skip. Naruto will be faced off against Neji Hyuga. Sasuke will be facing against Gara. <clears throat> Tamari will be against Shikamaru. Konkuro versus Shino. And Dosu will be whoever wins against the fight, whoever wins and Shikamaru versus Tamari. And this is where they we go um, into the one month training period and this is actually where i'll be picking up the next part i'm sorry for leaving off right here but you get, i hope the next part is as good as this one if it is good at all i'm sorry i'll see you guys later peace